first example of some weird shit going on is going to be an invisible tank. Um, he was not there when I just looked, uh, but he may he may have been there and I just missed it because he was like a thousand miles away. Um, well, okay, that's fine. That's that's tank battle, you know. It happens, and I'm okay with that. So, um, I do. I, I must admit, I really like this map. I like these little trenches here. It gives me a Verdun kind of feel, like you know, like Verdun's going on in the background. We're in the tanks. It's just a really neat feeling. Um, so there's not a tank in sight. I'm just driving along. Artillery fire? Are you kidding me? Yeah, and I'm out of the arty zone, and I still get hit. Okay, I'm out of the artillery zone. I'm safe. I'm I'm using my cheat, my wall hacks here because that's essentially what this freaking artillery crap is. Every tank has it. It's just ridiculous. Uh, nothing going on around me. I do see an enemy plane coming in, and I think I'm relatively safe. And for the most part, I am. So I'm beating this. I'm beating this tank or this uh, plane back. It's a TU uh, something. It's one of the heavy Russian bombers. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna be taking that thing out with my machine gun. Uh, maybe with my main cannon. Maybe. So I'm waiting for him to pop back up, but I don't see anything. And all of a sudden, I've got all these teammates around me. I'm using my wall hacks again. I decide to drop it for good measure, trying to beat them back so we can get get our get the team back in the fight because we're getting our kicked. And whoa, wait, where did this guy come from? How did a KV-1, one of the slowest vehicles known to man, how did it get here? So we're having a tank battle. I'm like, oh. Yeah, and then, oh, Wellington, boom, out of nowhere, takes me out. Like, really, Gaijin, is it really necessary to have, I, I mean, I understand, I understand, right here I'm pissed off, so like, screw it, I understand you want to have the environment of planes and tanks and ah, 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 but is it really necessary for them to be bombers? Right here, this this idiot's going head on with me and I'm actually afraid I'm gonna lose this battle. I'm in anti-air. Why am I afraid of a plane? Why is he still shooting? So anyway, I'm doing my best. I actually see the bomb drop and I'm like, oh sh Like, wow, that was close. So, as you can see, there's a Spitfire in the air, uh, Kyle whatever's in the air bombers which should not be there because let's face it tanks are defenseless against the dive bombing uh, technique of the of the scumbags I'm gonna try not to cuss but when when they're in a bomber their clocks ticking they're about to they're about to run out of time they angle their nose straight down and drop their bombs a split second before they crash. There is no countermeasures for that. Why is that in the game? You're losing business because I, everybody I talked to have basically sworn off War Thunder just because of that. Now right here, I kill the guy, boom. He still hits me and kills me. Why is that a thing? Why are they able to ram me to death? It's bullshit. Gaijin, fix that. Make it to where you can't drop your bombs if you're less than a, a, a 50 feet all, uh, from the ground or something. But anyway, guys, I'm not going to rant all day. I'm big name for A through Z. Z game. Look, I can't even say my name right. Man, just like this video comment subscribe if you haven't already and share this shit. get guys in get tell them to get their heads out of their ass and fix this
This is some bullshit, sucker. Alright, so anyway. Whew.